everyone, what is up? It is me, Micah. This is probably the most exciting video I will ever do on my channel so far. Not my wedding day yet. I'll be taking you guys through my bridal gown fitting experience. I'm just super excited, obviously. But before that, let's go head downstairs and eat some sushi. Hi! Cheech, tell them she won this. I won a giveaway. She won I'm this. I'm a freaking expert in giveaways. How many giveaways have you won, Cheech? Six giveaways from December, which was last month. Ah, six na giveaways na siya na panalunan, guys. Chaga lang talaga. Come on, come on, let's eat this. Fix this. My mouth tastes like sushi. <laughs> so, unyang papag-usapan natin is yung wedding gown ko. Siyempre guys, hindi ko muna sa inyo papakita yung wedding gown ko, ba? But I'm going to talk about yung pinagbilan ko ng wedding gown. And I'm gonna show you guys clips of the other gowns that I was able to try. Super exciting. So, just to give you a brief background, I got my gown from this Instagram shop called Arcasa Morales. Actually, si Arcasa Morales, more on, nagpaparent sila ng mga gowns. Pero kasi meron silang mga ibang gowns that they also put up on sale. Eh, yung pinaka gusto ko na gown, sakto sale siya. So, inisip ko, i-rent ko pa ba siya? Wag na. Ibilin ko na, ba Para sa akin na lang siya. Although, the other gowns that I tried, yon mga for rent yon. So, before I get to that, gusto ko muna pag-usapan yung experience ko talking to the owner of Arcasa Morales first prior to actually going there to fit the gowns. Ms. Ital is the owner of Arcasa Morales and she is just the nicest. I've talked about this before before dun sa wedding gown update ko. But anyway, my sister recommended Orcasa Morales to me. Actually, sila yung pinaka-first option ko. Pero syempre, as a bride, ba, you would think, ayaw mo naman na go ka na agad dun sa first option mo. But then, at the end of the day, I still went back to Orcasa Morales. Pinakita ko na kay Miss Ital yung mga gusto kong i-fit. Gaganda talaga lahat, guys. Actually, nahirapan talaga akong pumili kung anong gusto kong i-fit. Given the chance na wala lang COVID, and of course, for safety purposes, I would have probably fit more than five dresses. Talk to Miss Etal. It was so easy talking to her. She just gave me directions going to her place. And yeah, it was all set. She was very kind. Not once did I have a problem when it comes to communicating with her. Sobrang smooth niya kausap and katransak. So, nung nagpunta kami doon ng sister ko, nakaready naman lahat. Merong malaking-malaking mirror. Tapos so, nakahang na yung mga ifi-fit na mga damit. And si Miss Etal mismo bibigyan ka pa niya ng water. Tapos nun, mag a siya sa para siya yung magka-close ng mga corset. The first gown that I tried is called Morena. May mga nag-comment sa inyo doon. A lot of you really loved it. May mga nag-private message pa sa akin. Disclaimer lang guys ha, hindi ako magaling mag-explain ng mga wedding gown or the designs of the wedding gown or the style. I don't even know much about the fabrics. I'm going to try to explain as much as I can though I am not an expert or claiming to be at all. So Morena is a gown that has a lot of like mga flower embroidery, meron ding mga pearls on there, I believe. Pagkatapos, ang gustong gusto ko sa kanya, yung style niya na parang it dips super low and then, yung neckline niya ends almost under my ribs if I'm not mistaken. The tool is very light. You are not gonna have a hard time at all walking down the aisle with Morena on you. What I love most about Morena is that hindi kinilangan na sobrang bongga siya or sobrang dami niyang mga burloloy as they call it para maging eye-catching siya. It was already eye-catching as it was. In terms of the shade, definitely a warmer white, leaning towards ivory if I'm not mistaken. The second gown that I tried, eto naman si Nami. Sobrang pinilit ko talaga to, pero sinasabi na talaga sa kanil Miss Ital, malaki yan ha? malaki si Nami. Actually, malalaki daw yung mga gowns na pinipili ko. And recently, si Nami nagamit siya sa isang cathedral wedding. If you want to check it out yourself, do ask Miss Ital for the photos para lang you see what it looks like in the venue. Very, very big talaga si Nami and mabigat siya. So, si Nami naman off shoulders, more on mga sequence, yung detail niya. Gustong gusto ko rin to kasi mukha siyang may pagka Francis Libiran. Ang highlight sa akin ni Nami is yung pagka bongga niya and pagka ganda niya and yet it is still very simple. Next gown that I tried, well, eto na talaga yung gown ko. Maximum of three lang kasi talaga yung pwedeng itry pero actually Miss Etal was so kind to allow me to try one other gown which will I will talk to you guys about after this one. Eto, gown ko na to. 
this is it. Inaay ko pa lang to doon sa website. Nung nakita ko na siya, parang, wow, sobrang ganda nito. And it was totally unlike what I originally wanted. I wanted something very simple. Gusto ko bagsak lang and light lang. But again, the gown that I ended up choosing is like the complete opposite of what I initially wanted. Alam ko na, ito na yun. Like, ito na talaga yun. It wasn't like that overwhelming feeling naman, but it's more of when I saw it, I was like, I imagine myself walking down the aisle with this dress and of course, presenting myself as a bride to my groom in that dress. Kaya parang, sabi ko, hands down, this is it. I don't want to give too much details about it, so let's move on to the next gown. The next gown that I tried is called the Penelope, if I'm not mistaken. Ang ganda ganda nito ni Penelope, and Penelope is really cheap. It will only go for about, I think, 5,000 pesos. And yung gusto ko pa kay Penelope is that it's very simple, pero ang ganda nung mga details niya. I feel like if I didn't go for my gown, I would have probably went for Penelope. Siguro ang gagawin ko lang kakaiba kay Penelope is ipapasok ko yung straps. Yung straps kasi ni Penelope, it's a nude shade that's supposed to camouflage to your skin. Although, although yung pagka-nude kasi ng material ng strap, hindi niya kakulay yung skin tone ko. However, nung pinasok ko yung mga straps, tapos naging tube type siya or princess cut type siya na dress, nakita ko talaga yung potential na ang ganda ganda niya. Quick intermission lang guys, dapat kasi papakita talaga namin sa inyo kung ano yung mga apartment na chinek out na namin that we can possibly move into. However, I decided that it would be better to show you yung mga iba-ibang apartment na napuntahan namin at chinek out namin kapag nakasil na kami ng deal. Yung isa kasi doon, gusto-gusto na talaga namin siyang kunin. So, we're praying, praying, praying and by the time that we get it, then the apartment tour hunting video is gonna go up. Let's go back to this video. So that is it for my wedding gown. Sana na enjoy yun yung mga onting clips that I took and even the photos that I took. If you guys decide to try with our Casa Morales, sobrang may enjoy yung experience nyo and magiging memorable siya sa inyo. To all the bride to be's out there, please don't ever be afraid na magrent ng gown or bumili ng mga ready to wear. It's it's really okay. Ako kasi in my head it's more of I wanna invest in my marriage. I really don't want to put like yung mga gown yung venue first or like yung magiging itsura ng venue. Don't feel pressured because society is telling you that your wedding has to cost millions. No, definitely not your wedding does not have to cost that much me I'm excited for my wedding because it's another worship to God and I'm finally going to be one with the, the love of my life diba? actually the more you get to save the better kasi mas magagamit niyo yung pera na yun for your place mga furniture and apart from that savings syempre emergency funds and daming options sa Orcasa to rent meron pang mga iba na for sale if you guys are more interested in that and trust me when I tell you that you will get the gown of your dreams the fit of your dreams na swak pa sa budget nyo or much lower than what you were originally thinking of spending for your gown. Guys, sobrang exciting and natutuwa ako kasi nashishare ko yung mga bagay na to and it's something that I can even look back on kapag mas matanda na kami and nakita namin ni Adrian na ito yung time na naghahanap tayo ng bahay for the first time. Nabibigyan ko rin kayo ng mga ideas on what to consider kapag naghahanap ng bahay, naghahanap ng gown. Because I'm sure that most of you guys, parang nag-aaral pa kayo or wala pa kayo sa stage na magpapakasal kayo. So you can use these videos as future reference for when you guys are also engaged to the love of your life. The next few months will definitely be a stretch of me sharing to you guys how the wedding preparations have been going. And again, like what I said, it just excites me that I get to share all of this with you. It's almost as if I feel like I'm bringing you guys along with me as we do all these things together as a couple. Wala, it's very heartwarming to know that you guys have been there supporting Thing. Guys, best believe, may mga house tour ba tayo coming soon? Furniture shopping videos. All the exciting stuff that I've always been dreaming to do on my channel. I will finally get to do. And the best part is that, you know, I get to do it with my partner. And sobrang nagiging emotional talaga ako pag iniisip ko. Nagrabe blinis ako ni God with Adrian for 
us to be able to worship Him better. Parang grabe. Ang galing talaga. Sobrang. Ang galing ni Lord. Ang faithful niya. So yeah, thank you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. And for those of you who have been with me since like, what, three years ago. Thank you for choosing to stay. And there's so much more that we will experience together. So much more I cannot wait to share with you. Please do comment in the comment section what you guys would like to see from me. It doesn't have to be like engagement, wedding, or marriage related. It could be anything from beauty, fashion, or lifestyle. Again, I love you, my loves. And I'm leaving you guys with love, hope, and faith. For today, you watched me, Michael Lewis. And I really cannot wait to see you again. Bye, everyone!